Okay, let's talk about muscles. I'm going to go into muscle anatomy first. So we're going to look at the big, big skeletal muscle. Let's say this is a big biceps. This is dude's big biceps here. Okay. And there's a nice wrapper for this biceps. It's called the epimyceum. Um, just remember, remember epi, peri, endo. We're going to see that a lot. Because this skeletal muscle is made up of muscle fascicles. Okay. So um, whole muscle, muscle made up of fascicles. Okay, so now I'm going to look at this fascicle, and a fascicle is made up of many muscle fibers. A muscle fiber is another word for a muscle cell. And a muscle fascicle is surrounded by a paramyceum, and then the muscle fiber is, is surrounded by endomyceum. So a muscle fascicle has muscle fibers made up, okay, a muscle cell. Okay, now we're going to look at, um, this is the muscle fiber now, blown up. And this is made up of different things called myofibrils. Ignore this. Um, this is the same thing. It's going to be made up of myofibrils. Ignore this. Myofibril. This is one myofibril here. And a myofibril is made up of repeating units of something called sarcomeres. Okay, that's a sarcomere. That's a sarcomere. Um, so that's the breakdown. Okay. So this is epimyceum. This has perimyceum covering, and this has endomyceum. Okay, so this is really all you have to know. There's a lot of pictures, but this is it. Muscle fiber breaks down into multiple fascicles. Fascicles break down into multiple fibers. Fibers made up of repeating units of fibrils. Okay, and each fibril is made up of repeating units of sarcomeres, like we said before. Sarcomere, sarcomere. Okay, this sarcomere is the very basic unit. This is the very most basic currency of the muscle. And each sarcomere has varying zones. So, um, and we're gonna, I'm going to show you how to memorize all these zones because you're going to get tested on them, unfortunately. Uh, note that both skeletal muscles and cardiac muscles are made up of striated muscle fibers. So this, everything we covered is just striated muscle. Smooth muscle has a totally different structure. It's just... just weird structure but this is we're talking about skeletal and cardiac muscle here now when we look at the sarcomere we have varying regions um m line is straight down the middle m line is down the middle so easy to remember z line here is the definition of the end of each sarcomere they're the book ends of the sarcomere z is at the end of the alphabet so z is at the ends of the sarcomere the I band is the region, I band is right here, with only covering thin filament. So thin filament is this green stuff, remember that what that was? That was actin. It's the I band. So I is the thin letter, so I is the region with only the thin filaments. Then we look at the H zone. H zone is here. H zone is the region covering only the thick filaments. So remember what that was? That was myosin. H is thick, so H... It's on the region with the only thick filament. And then finally, we have the A band, which is the portion with both thick and thin. So it basically covers the whole myosin filament. And it covers both thick filament and thin filament. So if you remember that, then you pretty much know the regions of the sarcomere. Remember, M is down the middle, so M is in the middle. Z is the ends of the alphabet, so book ends of the sarcomere. I is the thin, I is thin, so it's just the car part portion with only the thin filament and then H is thick so it's the portion with only thick filament and A, A band is the portion with both thick and thin. So that is it for our review of the sarcomere and muscle anatomy.